We must stand by all our democratic allies, and we must not break faith with those who are risking their lives on every continent from Afghanistan to Nicaragua, from Afghanistan to Nicaragua, to defy Soviet-supported aggression and secure rights which have been ours from birth. The security and stability of the Persian Gulf must be assured and American citizens abroad must be protected. Out of these troubled times, our fifth objective, a new world order, a new world order can emerge. A new era, a new era, freer, freer, freer from the threat of terror, stronger in the pursuit of justice, and more secure in the quest for peace. Kosovo is not an easy problem, but if we don't stop the conflict now, it clearly will spread and then we will not be able to stop it except at far greater cost and risk. Uh, it's going to be important for nations to know they will be held accountable for inactivity, for inactivity. You're either with us or you're against us. You're either with us or you're against us in the fight against terror. Sometimes the course of history poses challenges that threaten our common humanity and our common security. Some nations may be able to turn a blind eye to atrocities in other countries. The United States of America is different. And as president, I refuse to wait for the images of slaughter and mass graves before taking action. 